Mikey, Mikey! What's that sound outside? JJ, I don't know. I think something happened to the villagers, and they are scared. Where are they? Oh my god! Who are they running so frightened from? Hmm, that's weird. JJ, I think one was trying to tell us something. Run! You fools! They're coming! They will kill us all! Run! Oh no! Mikey, it's the zombie apocalypse, and it looks like it's bad! There are too many zombies, and they have already started infecting the rest of the villagers. Oops, run into the house before that huge zombie mutant sees us. JJ, we need to find out what's going on. Let's turn on the radio and hear what's being broadcast. Maybe it's all a hoax, or maybe we really are in the apocalypse. Attention all listeners, a zombie epidemic has broken out in the world, and we don't know how to stop it. To avoid getting infected, stay home and don't let the zombies bite you. We are already fighting it, and soon we will find a way to defeat all zombies. Wait, what? We already have them! Run! Save it! JJ, it doesn't look like a prank, and it's very dangerous for us to walk the streets. Oh no, Mikey. That mutant spotted us, and now he's broken our wall. <coughs> We're finished. Goodbye, Mikey! Oh, where am I? Why is there ground everywhere? Hmm, looks like something happened, but I don't remember anything. Wait, what? I'm dead. Is this my grave? But then where is Mikey? Is he dead or alive too? I'll check it out. I remembered everything. There was a zombie apocalypse and now everyone is a zombie. They don't touch me. Why is that? That's it. I got it. Because I became a zombie too. It's a strange feeling. I don't breathe and I don't want to eat anything. Mikey, where's Mikey? Oops, I think this place looks like a grave. How did I end up here? Mikey, I'm here. I'm glad you're almost alive. Oh no, you horrible zombie, go away. I'm afraid of zombies, don't touch me. Mikey, don't you recognize me? I'm JJ. You and I died in the apocalypse and now we're zombies. Are we zombies now? What do I look like now? Let me guess, I'm still green, right? Yeah, Mikey, you're still green. But now I'm green, too, and our eyes are red. We need to figure out how much sleep we got. After all, the world around us has aged a lot, and it's probably been a couple of months. There are graves everywhere. There doesn't seem to be a single living villager around. There are only zombies everywhere. Mikey, it looks like the apocalypse was a long time coming, and apparently they haven't come up with a cure yet. We should find any places with scientists, if there are any, and make vaccines. You're exactly right. Let's go listen to the radio first and see if there are any survivors. Okay, I'll ask the audience a question. Hey viewers, which is better zombies JJ and Mikey or people JJ and Mikey? Should we find a cure to become normal? Write your answer in the comments. Thank you. JJ, hurry up and go inside and turn on the radio. There will definitely be survivors there, and they will tell us where they are and how to find them. Oh Mikey, our house is really abandoned. Now there's grass growing all over the floor and holes in the roof. Alright, I'm turning on the radio. Attention survivors. Today marks exactly the third year of the infection. We still haven't found a cure for the virus. But we do have news. We have learned that there are experimental potions in one of the mountain laboratories. They can cure zombies and make them human. The survivors of Bunker 91 were with you. JJ, we were there for three whole years. That's awful. But now we know there is a vaccine and we have to go to that lab. Exactly right. Now let's go get our armor and sword and go over there. I'm sure it will be dangerous and there will also be aggressive zombies. So we have to be protected from them and take the armor. I'll get myself some iron armor. I like it better than diamond and gold. JJ, do you think we can heal and cure the others of the zombie virus? We definitely can. Mikey Mikey, let's go there quickly, because maybe the evil people who created the zombie virus will get there before us. They might want to destroy these vaccines. Mikey, you're down. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Let's go there quickly. I'm even ready for a battle. Well JJ, now you and I are zombies and other zombies don't touch us at all. This means that we are not afraid of any monsters because we are monsters now. That's a big plus of being a zombie. But also I can't eat cakes now, it's already horrible. It's okay, we'll find a cure and you can eat cakes. There's the lab. Mikey, it looks like it's very secret. Look at what it looks like. 
There's definitely a cure in there, and we can find it. Then let's hurry up and find a cure. I'm sure we'll have to fight someone on the way. But I don't know who yet. Hmm, these doors are pretty rusty, and it looks like this lab is a little abandoned as well. Oh no, Mikey, it looks like these zombies are the former staff of this place. They were scientists, but they became zombies too. Maybe they didn't have time to heal. There are a lot of them here. I'm sad about that. After all, they were definitely supposed to save the world, but they didn't make it. Mikey, Mikey, let's go over there. There's a ladder. It leads to the second floor, and it looks like there's something there. Okay, come on, JJ. Hmm, I hear the sound of lasers. Is that it? That's right, look. It's a laser wall. It's very dangerous. It's dangerous, but we were able to get between the laser beams because we're skinny. Look, it's a laser rifle, a minigun, and golden apples. JJ, it looks like there's a boss ahead and we're going to try to beat him. Exactly right. Also, I see that this weapon is extremely strong and someone left it here for others who will enter. Oh my god! It's the horrible mutant that killed us three years ago. It's the same one. Mikey, we must defeat it or it will destroy us and everything will end. It looks like it worked. He's dead. Oops, there were zombies all around. Oh no, he's not dead. He just passed out. He is very strong. After all, after so many shots, he's still getting up. It looks like we have to try very hard to kill him. Okay, we did it. Now let's move on and see what's on the third floor. Mikey, this is the top floor and there's definitely a vaccine for the zombie virus. Definitely. Look, it's a password chest. We need to figure out what its password is so we can open it. I'll look in the neighboring bollards. Mikey Mikey, look also in them. There are no more places where the password can be hidden. Yay, I found the password. It's in this book, and the password is 34213. Now we are going to open this chest. I enter 34213. Finally. JJ, this is the cure. You have to experience it for yourself first. Now we'll see if it works. Mikey, you seem to be looking normal already. That means we can cure more than just ourselves, but also millions of other people. Let's cure these villagers. They certainly deserve to be non-zombies. Exactly. I hope it works for the villagers. They've been sick for a long time, and it looks like they're really sick of it. Something seems to be going on. They're starting to walk faster. Look. Finally, hooray! Mikey, all that's left is to heal the other villagers. We'll do it in a few days. Hey viewers, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like this video. Check out our other videos. Bye bye, thanks for watching, see you later.